if you've ever ridden an R1, or any 1,000cc sport bike for that matter, you've probably thought to yourself, just once I wish I could ride the race version of this motorcycle. Well, be careful what you ask for. Introducing the all new 2015 R1M. For those who've always wanted to own a full race machine, the line between Superbike and MotoGP bike has now been officially blurred. Similar to the 2015 R1, the R1M has the same engine layout as its first cousin, the amazing Yamaha YZR M1. With high revving power, precision handling, and a MotoGP proven electronics package, plus even more performance features that take this ultimate superbike to a whole new level. In addition to all new dynamic styling, the R1M presents a compact profile with improved aerodynamics and 8% gain over the previous model. The R1M is the closest street bike I've ever ridden to one of my actual race bikes. Probably better in some respects because it's so much smaller and more compact to begin with. I've ridden this bike through testing and development, and I can tell you, I can't wait to show the competition my new weapon. Weight is the enemy of any high-performance racing machine. The R1M's all-new aluminum delta box frame and magnesium subframe contribute to a lightweight and compact chassis design. The aluminum frame is both strong and flexible, with rigid engine mounts, making the engine a stressed member of the frame for optimal rigidity balance. Ultra-lightweight materials are used throughout, like carbon fiber body components, with unique R1M color and graphics, and the exclusive R1M badge on top of the airbox cover and a brightly polished aluminum 4.5 gallon fuel tank, weighing in at a full 3.5 pounds less than steel, along with a polished aluminum swing arm for another hit of style. 10 spoke cast magnesium wheels that reduce rotational mass by 1.9 pounds over the previous model with high grip Bridgestone tires. Plus, the wheelbase is 10 millimeters shorter than the previous R1, adding to cornering performance. However, the ratio of swing arm length to wheelbase is 40.5%, the same as the previous model year for excellent linear stability. And the all-new four-piston radial mounted front calipers ride on big 320 millimeter rotors for amazing stopping power. Plus, the track-tested racing ABS and unified braking system provide maximum braking performance in a seamless manner. UBS inhibits unwanted rear motion during braking by activating the rear brake when the front brake is applied, with force distribution based on the bike's attitude and lean angle. Every component, every detail of the R1M has been analyzed, redesigned, and built for speed and nimble handling, plus an exclusive image all its own. Guys, this bike is light. And what the engineers came up with for this 2015 cross-plane crankshaft engine this bike is just plain fast. The heart of the R1N is its all new, more compact engine, which in addition to an ultra high compression ratio, also features Yamaha's MotoGP proven cross plane crankshaft and new titanium fracture split connecting rods, providing a linear throttle control feeling and a great feeling of torque, a direct connection from throttle to rear wheel for amazing acceleration from a corner especially at maximum leaning situations. The all-new engine also features twin injectors on each cylinder with a bi-directional spray in the lower injector, where fuel is directed towards the back of the intake valves, boosting the number of droplets that go directly into the combustion chamber. At high RPMs, the secondary injector adds a boost in the fuel delivery. The entire fuel delivery system is monitored with ride-by-wire accuracy and the patented Yamaha chip control throttle system. The engine also features aluminum engine bolts and magnesium oil sump, head, and side covers for even greater weight reduction. As awesome as this engine is, it's the electronics that really stand out. This kind of adjustability used to only be available on full-blown MotoGP bikes, but now for the first time, you guys are gonna have it on a production machine right at your fingertips. 
The R1M features the most advanced MotoGP-inspired electronics package ever offered on any production motorcycle. A full suite of interrelated technologies, enabling the rider to enjoy the fullest range of performance with greater comfort, control, and ease of operation. At its core is a six-axis inertial measurement unit, the first ever six-axis IMU on a production bike. It consists of a gyro sensor that measures pitch, roll, and yaw, as well as an accelerometer or G-sensor that measures acceleration in the fore-aft, up-down, and right-left directions, all at a rate of 125 calculations per second. By calculating each signal, the IMU finds the precise vehicle position and movement and communicates it to the ECU, enabling it to control the bike systems. Like the new variable traction control system, by calculating the differential in front to rear wheel speed, as well as the lean angle, it helps prevent rear wheel spin when exiting corners. As lean angle increases, so does the amount of control, with 10 separate settings, so riders can dial in the exact level of control they want. The slide control system, the first of its kind on a production motorcycle, comes directly from the YZR M1. If the gyro sensor detects too much yaw while accelerating during hard leaning conditions, the ECU will step in and control the engine power to reduce the slide. This too can be adjusted by the rider. A lift control system detects front to rear pitching rate and enables the ECU to reduce front wheel lift during acceleration with a total of four settings. In a race, the rider who starts fastest often finishes first. The R1M's launch control system provides three different settings to regulate engine speed and power output, achieving the fastest possible standing start. The R1M's quick shift system cuts engine power so riders can upshift without using the clutch and closing the throttle for quicker lap times, also with three variable settings. Power delivery mode, similar to the earlier D mode system, lets the rider choose from four settings of throttle valve opening rate in relation to the degree of throttle grip opening to best match the riding conditions. Finally, the Yamaha Ride Control System allows the rider to fine-tune each of the systems easily in the meter using the handlebar scroll wheel, power mode, traction, slide, launch, lift, and quick shift. And then save those settings as one of four optional presets. The number one thing I look for in a motorcycle, heck, any competitive rider looks for, is front-end feel. That's the key to fast lap times. As important as engine power, and Yamaha came up with an awesome solution for that. The R1M features a highly advanced Owens electronic racing suspension. The suspension control unit receives data from the inertial measurement unit, then adjusts the front and rear compression, as well as rebound damping for optimum suspension performance. The system comes with two modes. Automatic mode continuously adjusts rebound and compression damping as you ride providing ideal damping force for the track or the street, and can be fine-tuned to the rider's needs. The manual mode allows riders to fine-tune the settings they choose, then hold these settings while riding. When you put it all together, the electronics, the Olin suspension, and that bar one engine, this bike just surpasses the competition. It's easy to set up the way I like, easier to ride fast, and this R1M, it just takes the game to a whole new level. The R1M features a thin film transistor LCD meter with brilliant color for precise monitoring of all vehicle systems, including front brake pressure and fore-aft G-force, making it easier than ever to take the bike to its limits. It features both a street mode as well as a track mode that focuses on information more important when on a track, such as your YRC settings, a zoomed-in view of the tachometer in the upper RPM range, lap timer with a best lap and last lap feature, gear position indicator, and speed, just to name a few. All new LED headlights are both lightweight and compact, allowing for a more aerodynamic design and layout of the front face. And all new LED front turn signals are integrated into the mirrors for improved aerodynamics. Another feature exclusive to the R1M that takes electronic control to an all-new level is the Yamaha Exclusive Communication Control Unit. 
The CCU allows riders to communicate with the vehicle via Wi-Fi through Yamaha's exclusive Y-Track smartphone and tablet app. The onboard system is comprised of the CCU and GPS antenna. Running data can be recorded via a data logger with the course mapping and automatic lap timings managed by GPS. This data can then be wirelessly downloaded to the Android or iOS app, where you can study it and even make setting changes to later upload to the R1M. This Yamaha exclusive Y-Track system gives you an all-new connection to your machine that has never been seen outside of the factory race pits, further blurring that line between production superbike and MotoGP bike. Bottom line, the R1M is as close to a full-blown race bike as I've ever seen in a production bike. The word evolutionary gets thrown around a lot. The R1M, it's not evolutionary, it's revolutionary. It's so far ahead of the competition, it's hard to even make a comparison. This bike, it's in a league of its own. The all-new R1M from Yamaha. Consider the line between MotoGP and production superbikes officially blurred.